England are coming into the series in pretty good form. Do you think it's going to be, obviously, you think it's close? Yeah, England are in pretty good form. Uh, but I, th I think Australia will do them. I think the two, two key are Strauss, Strauss and Peterson. We can get them out early. I, th I think uh, the top order will collapse. Do you think it's going to be a close series? Obviously, England's coming into the series with pretty good form. Yeah, yeah. Oh, not bad. I mean, we love our Aussies whether they lose or not, but yeah, no, it should be pretty good, actually. Yeah, I like that attitude. It looks like a good youthful squad, lots of healthy competition, and hopefully it'll be a good team to win us the Ashes again. Yeah. Are you happy with how England's playing at the moment? Oh yes, yeah, we, we seem to have a, a well-balanced side, you know, and I think, our prep, as I've been saying, our preparation this time around seems to be a lot better than last time. Obviously, we got a, a bit of a smack in last time. And, uh, hopefully you sure did, I'm glad you brought that up. Yeah, as well. There's a few Australians <laughs> around me, so I won't, I won't say too much. But, uh, Yes, I think it'll be it'll be different. It'll be very close. I think that uh, what I know Australia have not been informed, but I think it's the two evenly matched sides, and uh, it's going to be a keenly contested series. I think it's very important that the Australian captain Ricky Ponting does well. I, I really don't think Australia need to have question marks about his uh, about his captaincy and his lead, leadership, and I think they'll go away very fast if he makes a hundred or two early on. And of course, if he does that, he'll set Australia up and he just needs some support from his other batsmen. The bowling for me is a bit of a mystery. I, I really think um, it's about swing, and uh, that's why I come down in favour of England just a little bit. Uh, they have been swinging the cricket ball, and batsmen seem to be struggling with swing bowling. But with so many injuries uh, occurring these days, you know, who knows who's going to be fronting for who. Uh, I also think England have got a slight edge in the spin department, so those are just a few thoughts. We've had, I suppose, over the last 11 or 12 years, a lot of one-sided series in Australia. Uh, the Australian side dominated for a number of years over the last decade or so. I don't think we're going to see that this year. I think we're going to see a very uh, keenly fought series with a session going to one side, then maybe the next session going to the other. And I think that's going to make for very interesting cricket, not just for the players, but for the spectators and also for us commentators. Go the Aussies!